Um, what's up guys, my name is Neville's Taylor, and so I went off to go do something the other day that was pretty, kind of like, ballsy. Um, I'm still kind of like, questioning, I'm like, <laughs> holy shit, do I actually just get that done? So, I got my first tattoo done, um, my first ever tattoo, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, and it was more the anxiety that kind of like, drew me away from the idea of getting a tattoo, but, and it was kind of like... You know, should I get this done? Should I not? Is it gonna hurt like shit? And yes, it did hurt, as all needles usually do. You know, it didn't tickle, and it didn't kind of like freaking, um, kind of like just stay still. No, 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 it didn't. It was it was pretty painful for the first kind of like five minutes. And it was actually the outline that hurt more than the inside of the tattoo. And I was like, okay, is the color gonna hurt more? And like, no, it wasn't. It was actually, no, I mean. Now the tattoo itself was kind of like pretty straightforward. Um, three hours of sitting there and just waiting patiently for it, for it to bloody end. Um, and I got a few breaks in between, you know, just to get half of it done, and then the next part, and then so on and so forth. And I wouldn't recommend, obviously, tattoos for everyone, but I'd recommend, um, you know, for my, kind of like my advice for people that are on the spectrum and for people that are like tr trying to aim to get those done eventually, just be patient and just be kind of like talkative and don't <laughs> fucking freak out. That's the best advice I can give anyone. Do not freak out because if you freak out, it's going to get even worse for you. And if you start moving and fidgeting, then the needle's just going to go everywhere and it's going to fuck up a perfectly p good piece of art because it is, it is absolutely beautiful. And so what it said, sometimes it is taken, sometimes it is not, but there is no bargain for here. What is, is what must be. And so that's why Watership Down by Richard Adams. Um, and I wanted to get something very, very special and very, very unique that was very, very close to me and that was gonna be on the, my skin for the rest of my life. And I thought, okay, I've done a good job. I didn't get a tramp stamp or anything stupid. Um, and I'm very, very proud of myself and I feel very manly to get something I've never done before. I didn't, ha didn't even have anyone sitting there with me um, most of the time. So, yeah, I just wanted to kind of like um, share that experience. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all next time.